So, in today's fourth upload will be the normal fourth upload, which is my, what I like and dislike about all the episodes of Doctor Who Part 16. So, the 151st uh, story, or episode story, I would like to call it a story, was the greatest show in the galaxy. Now, what I liked, it was okay, what I liked about it was some of the acting was actually quite good. Uh, Sylvester McCoy was okay, Ace was good, or Doctor was good, Ace was good. Uh, some of the acting wasn't good, the storyline wasn't that good. Overall, it wasn't that good of a story, but it was okay. I do like Doctor Who, though, so I'm going to say everything's okay. 152 was Battlefield. Now, this was really good. I did like it because the Brigadier was in it. Brigadier Alistair Gordon left with Stuart, if I remember rightly. This was his last regular appearance in the show, unless you count Dimensions in Time, he appeared. But if you don't count that as an actual canon to the show, this is his last regular appearance. <laughs> he got mentioned in Sarah Jane Adventures, in Sarah Jane Adventures, but that's not technically Doctor Who. Depends if you count that as Doctor. If he was, he done the Matt. I think he done Matt Smith. No, David Tennant. No, because it was the wedding of Sarah Jane he was in. Hundred and fifty third was Ghostlight. Now, I haven't actually watched this, so I can't say anything about it. 154 was Curse of Fenric. Now, this was good. The act, some of the acting was good, but some of it wasn't ba uh, was, was bad. It wasn't too bad. And overall, it was an okay story. I would I would, would suggest you to watch it, and I have watched it a few times. 155. Now, this was a bit of a sad one, if you think of it in one terms. The Survival. I haven't actually watched this, sadly, but it's sad for one reason, it's the last of classic era. Sad, I know. But, you little threat. 156th was the TV movie. It was actually, actually good. It was actually good. I've watched it about five times and it is actually really good. Paul McGowan was excellent in it. Some of the special effects and some of the acting was a bit off, but Seth McCoy was in it, because he had a regeneration. But sadly, that was it. That was it. Stopped. Right up until... Good news. 2005 with a 157th story, quite a rose, with Christopher Eccleston as the Doctor this time, with the Ninth Doctor. Now, I actually watched this when it first aired. I've watched every single episode of New Era. Now this was really good, because it's the first ever one I had seen basically going out first, and to me it captivated me, being young, I was a matter of six at the time, and it was really good, I enjoyed it. I, I've been hooked with this show since. 158th was the end of the world. Uh, now, I can't really remember this, but I remember it is, um, there was this person's skin, just a layer of skin, what I thought was good, and I found it a bit weird. For being six, you find anything weird, but hey-ho. 158th, or 159th, I'm sorry, was the unquest, the unquested death, I think, or some dead, sorry. Now, I can't really remember this, but I, it was really good. It was based in Victorian times, so it might have, been, might have been Bad Wolf, I might be thinking about. And 160th was Aliens of uh, London. Now, this is technically two stories, but it's 106 and 60A, but for quickness, I just thought I'd do one story because it's still technically the same story but what I remember it is good because um, I think it was a spaceship went straight through uh, Elizabeth Tower so as always all information is correct as of recording which is July 11th 2019 and this what time I am recording and it's what according to my watch and I would actually like to say an apology I actually swore in a video earlier um, I didn't mean to, it just slipped out. I know in my songs I have sworn, but I have warned you at the beginning of the video, but I didn't put a warning saying there was a swear word in it, because I didn't know I was going to swear. It was for um, when Katie commented. Um, it's just say I said the S word. I said, ah, oh, I didn't know she commented. But, um, I was thinking about doing Weekend the Hills, but it has a load of swearing in it. I was thinking about doing it. If you want me to do the Weekend the Hills as a song for <laughs> tomorrow's first upload, I can do that. I can do it. 
the chest was worn, it has a lot of swears because um, 